here is an example of binomial probability distribution assume that male and female births are equally likely and that the birth of any child does not affect the probability of the gender of any other children find the probability of at most three girls in 10 births so in this case uh, we have to find at most a probability of at most three girls here in 10 children right so in 10 uh, total births so in terms of uh, binomial probability distribution right so there's n is uh, 10 and we have to find the probability of at most three girls so let x uh, is number of successes and here in this case number of successes mean the number of girls birth so we have to find the probability at most three so x is less or equal to three yes uh, this lower case p so that would be 50 percent because male and female are equally likely here it says that so it's 50 percent 50 percent are 0.50 so now probability of x is less or equal to 3 that we have to find so we would express it first like this one so x is less or equal to 3 so that's equal to probability when x is 0 plus probability when x is 1 plus probability when x is 2 plus probability when x is 3 and now we have to individually compute each of them and before I do this I just show you this equation here so this is a equation for the binomial probability distribution and when in this case so in the first part here so this is x is 0 n is we already know that n is 10 that's fixed and lowercase p is that 0 0.05 so we have to just plug in there so p of 0 would be uh, 10 c 0 and then probability of success 0 0.50 to the 0 and then 1 minus p so 1 minus 0.5 5 to 0 10 minus 0 which is 10 similarly we write the equation for this p of 1 so that would be 10 c1 and then 0 0.5 to the 1 and then 1 minus 0 0.05 is the same as 0 0.05 to the 10 minus 1 so which is equal to 9 Similarly, for P of 2 here, so that is 10 C2, 0 0.50 to the 2, and 1 minus 0 0.50 is the same as 0 0.50, so 10 minus 2, so that's equal to 8, then plus for this one P of 3, so that is 10 C3, 0 0.5. 0 to the 3 and times 1 minus 0 0.50 is the 0 0.50 7 so now this would simplify so 10 c 0 is uh, 1 1 times uh, 0 0.50 to the uh, 0 and then this is to the 10 so this thing simplify into 10 similarly 10 c1 so this part is give us 10 and then this part gave us like 0 0.5 to 0 to the 10 then this part here so this one 10 c2 here so this would give us like uh, 45 so then this part here uh, 
zero point five to the ten, and then from this thing, so this gave us like hundred twenty, and then zero point five zero to the this one, so the exponent should add so to the ten, and this whole thing would simplify into uh, zero point one seven. And that's the final answer.